Lamborghini Automobile Troubleshooting. If you're looking for help fixing your Lamborghini automobile, look no further. Our comprehensive Lamborghini Automobile Troubleshooting Guide will explain common issues, provide tips, and show you how to read your model's error codes. Worn out brake pads. It is dangerous to drive a car with worn out brake pads. The brake pads wear out due to constant friction. When they wear out, you will often notice a squeaking sound. Besides, you will need to hard press the brakes for them to be effective. This can be disastrous during emergency braking. Have your mechanic inspect your brake pads if you suspect that there is something wrong with them. Smoke from the exhaust. A functioning car produces some smoke in terms of exhaust gases. This is often colorless unless when you are starting your car during winter. However, excessive smoke is a signal of serious engine trouble. The color and smell of the smoke will offer clues as to what is wrong. If the smoke is white, then it may be your coolant that could be leaking. While if you have thick blue colored smoke, it could be oil getting into the combustion chambers. If it is black, it can mean that the engine is running too rich in fuel. Oil pressure problems. Oil plays a vital role in lubricating all the moving parts in the car. When your oil is old, it will form a sludge that makes it hard to operate efficiently. This will cause unnecessary friction amongst the movable parts leading to overheating and wear. Oil pressure problems are something you never want because it can result in expensive repair costs like engine replacements. Also, identify the right type of oil that has offers good viscosity. Nowadays, many motorists prefer using synthetic oils. Low charge from alternator. When your car starts to get old, the effect from the alternator will get worse and worse. This is due to the brushes inside of it is getting worn. You can replace the brushes in some cases, but sometimes you have to replace the whole alternator. Checking the alternator with a multimeter is easy. You should have around 13.5 14.5 volts on idle if it is working properly. Overheating. When your car is overheating, it could be a signal for serious engine trouble. The internal combustion system produces a lot of heat. The coolant plays the vital role of cooling the engine block by dissipating excess heat to the radiator. However, coolant leaks could mean that less coolant is reaching the engine block. This can cause overheating, which, when not contained, can lead to further engine problems. Stalling. This can cause new motorists alarm. You are driving smoothly then all of a sudden the car comes to a complete halt in the middle of the road. If this happens on a highway, you may find yourself causing serious accidents. The car stalling's main reason includes faulty filters, fuel lines, or defective crankshaft position sensor. Bad wheel bearings. Bad wheel bearings are a common issue in modern cars. You can hear a wheel bearing when you are driving at higher speeds. You will identify a bad wheel bearing by listening to the road sound while turning slowly left or right. If the noise changes, you do for sure have a bad wheel bearing. Squeaking or grinding brakes. Squeaking or grinding brakes can often be caused by worn brake pads or worn brake discs. It can also happen if a stone gets stuck between the brake rotor and the brake pads. Worn brakes are very common in cars that are not getting cared for enough. SourceMechanicBase.com